Hello and welcome to another episode of The Bright Side. Do you know what? What? We're not too far away from Halloween. It's Halloween. One of the greatest festivals, holidays, whatever you like to refer to it as, of the calendar because it's just Halloween. It's amazing. I haven't really got a Halloween t-shirt. I've got a couple of ones that could be, you know, yeah. sort of worn. <laughs> But I thought, what could be more terrifying than this? Seagulls. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> or your body. <laughs> Seagulls. So we are going to, so the kids are in school and we're going to surprise them later by having the house decorated. For we're going for it uh, for Halloween. Not Christmas. Not Christmas, no, not Christmas. That really would be horrifying at this time of year, wouldn't it? But we are going to go to the store first because there's a few little bits that we would like to get. Now, there's not for a huge... Outside. For outside, yeah. There's not a huge amount of choice, after all. This is the UK. We're not... <laughs> We've struggled. We're, struggled. We're, we're not great at Halloween. We try and make the best of it, but we're going to go to the range and see if we can find some little bits and pieces just to add to the exterior of our homestead. But we'll certainly be decorating inside and then the kids will be like, you know, they'll be quite pleased with that, I would imagine. Because we do go all out. We do. So let's go check it out. Got a hat? I have. Okay, made it to the range, the Penzance range. We did recently go to the Truro range, didn't we? And a couple of the Truro shops, which we found very disappointing. <laughs> Um, we did document that, so I will leave a link in the description if you want to see that video. Uh, but yes, that was a, a rather horrific show by a few of the stores where there just wasn't hardly anything out on the shelves. Um, but we'll see if the Penzance range has got a better range. And I do see some spooky stuff there in the entrance as we come in. Oh yes, look at that. This is more promising much more promising. Look at this, like, casket with, like, the skeletal hand breaking out. Yes, okay. All of the Halloween decor in this store is upstairs. It was downstairs, wasn't it, in the Truro range? Yes, but they've got autumnal. Yeah, I was going to say they got an autumnal. They had a few autumnal bits, to be fair, in Truro's range. I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, this range it's is going to be, it's the same <laughs> shop, essentially. Um, but yeah, I think this is, this is a newer shop. The one in Truro is an older store, and I think that this one in Penzance is actually a much nicer store. Um, you feel you've got a lot more headroom upstairs. Uh, so, right, let's let's head upstairs. Where's Shelby? What are you doing? What are you doing? We've got decorations to look at. I'm looking at bath mats that are pumpkins. Oh, a pumpkin bath mat. <laughs> yeah, okay. Downstairs, the customer service is blooming. Yeah, he's quite cute, isn't he? Okay, they've got a yes and a no, just in case you were confused. Look at all these severed appendages. Hey, Shelbel. High five. Okay, check out this guitar. Do you remember the torso guitar in from Dust Till Dawn? You don't remember the band when it started playing at the end of the movie? <laughs> you clearly blanked it out. It's a rather fearsome looking dog and a rat. A small dog compared to the rat. What the heck is that? Like this rather pedestrian looking bear, and then he's holding like a skull. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I know they're the same, I know they're the same store. Yeah. But there does seem to be more here in the Penzance one. I don't know, what, what do you think? Gravestones up there. Yeah, so what we were looking for is these gravestones because we're going to make like the front yard into like a cemetery. Maybe some bones too. Yeah. So we could get like a pack of bones. 
Probably. And then some of these tombstones. Just gonna pan the camera around. Yeah, I think there's definitely more, I, I think there's more stuff here. But, but again, this is a bigger store. The Penzance store is bigger than the Truro store. Hmm. They had this in the Truro one, the Ghoulish Gourd, which was the pub and grill. Penny shy of £30. I don't think we're in the market for that. <laughs> and there's that little dog. He's quite cute. He's quite cute, isn't he? I quite like him. A skeleton bulldog. Penny shy of ten pounds. Okay. And there's that freaky doll. Whoa. With like the detached legs. So she can cycle. She or they? They? This horrific creature was in the Truro store. I assume it's motion activated. Oh, maybe it's not. Oh. Okay, that's what you do. Freaky. You see these sorts of clowns always makes you think of like poltergeist where the clown was sort of there in full swing in that movie. more of those torso, well they're not torso guitars, they're like skeleton guitars, aren't they? Penny shy of ten pounds. Jack-o'-lantern there with skeletal hands over its face. <laughs> they put by the gravestones. Yeah, are they like waterproof? Are they, yeah, they're like, um, they'd be alright, wouldn't they? Okay, cool. And then you've got this guy. <laughs> Leaving the range with our haul. There's some chocolate there that I snuck in. All right, let's head home and get decorating. We've actually just stopped off at Sainsbury's a minute here in Penzance because we did notice the other day when we were here, they did have a reasonable amount of Halloween stuff. We're not particularly gonna buy any more, but we do just want to showcase some of the bits that they've got here on offer. So we'll head into Sainsbury's a minute. Plus we just needed to pick up a little bit of lunch as well. Literally as you enter the store, you've got all the fruit and veg there, entrance there. You've got all their Halloween stuff. So obviously some like tableware, like your cups, mugs, that type of thing. And napkins, <laughs> dragon skull, amazing. I'm always like confused when it says temporary out of stock. Am I missing something on that? No. Maybe they haven't taken it off, no. Um, right, what else? Witch's hat garland. Oh, I see. Just like a string of witches, right? Okay. Creepy fabric. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what makes fabric creepy? 
colour, shape, whether it's torn. <laughs> Cobwebs. Um, I, um, we got cobwebs, or I suppose it's only a quid. Maybe we, I don't know. Maybe we'll procure some cobwebs. Jack and Sally there in full effect. Beetlejuice. Actually, what did make me laugh? Um, I'll show you in a minute with some of the drinks, like Fanta and stuff like that. They've they've come up with some funny like names for their beverages, like seasonal names. Which I was well. laughing at, eh? They've got some gravestones as well. Oh, I've got some gravestones, oh yeah, trick or treat. Yeah, so actually Sainsbury's, I think, have got quite a good range of stuff, really. They've got, a, in, in a way, they've got like a better range than the range. <laughs> and I mean, we won't even talk about Dunelm up in Truro. I mean, that was appalling. Uh, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description if you want to see that video when we were very disappointed in Truro. Oh, do you make like make jelly out of it? You make yeah. make um, bra <laughs> brain shaped jelly. <laughs> All right. AJ's got that costume, isn't he? Yes, yes. It's the exact costume, isn't it? Near yeah. enough. I think his eyes are more um, plastic. Yeah, he's, he's got um, better. He yeah. No, I thought these did come with little pants, okay. didn't they? I thought they did yeah. originally. Oh, and they may be originally, but it was Tilly's originally. Oh, it was Tilly's, wasn't it? That's right. The funny thing is, though, do you know what is quite funny about that? It still fits him. It yeah. still fits him. That's, that's the bit that makes us laugh, because he was wearing it the other day. In fact, he was wearing it in that video, but I said I would leave a link to him in the description. <laughs> uh, right, let's just... And then, and then up here is just all the... Your sweets, your candy, your all... You know, chocolates, all that sort of stuff. But I was laughing. This is what was making me laugh. They've got Afterlife <laughs> Fanta, <laughs> which is an apple flavored drink, but it just made me, it made me laugh. And, and they, they've just put like these little seasonal um, like faces and whatnot on, on them, which uh, I, I did think that was, I did think that was uh, quite, quite funny. And also the Sainsbury's own band, uh, brand, the, Dra <laughs> the Dracola. <laughs> That's amazing. Up into the like the little grab and go area where you can just you know put together your lunch for your set price, and this caught my eye. What the heck is this? Don't think I'll be procuring one of those. Right, we are back home. We've eaten lunch. I've gone up into the loft and I've got all of our like existing stuff down ready to go and then that bag there is filled with the new stuff that we've bought today darth vader by the way is a usual sort of um he's an all year round he's, he's an all year round decoration there he's he's just there um just taking care of whatever he's doing that says more about our lives than i'm willing to admit we're going to clear the mantelpiece because we put stuff up on the mantelpiece and in this zone here we'll just hoover quickly and make just a few little bits there from the kids um uh, and in this spot, we'll move, we'll move that, and then that is where we put our Halloween tree, because you know, I mean, you've got to have a Halloween tree. So, right, we're gonna um, start taking things out of the box. Is plural and bag. We always test any given lights, don't we? Be it Christmas or Halloween. Like, so we always test them before we put them up because it would be a bit of a disaster. disaster, a bit of a waste of time if you were to string all your lights up and then you switch them on and they don't work because yes. then that would be, yeah, that would be a bit annoying. So, uh, right, let's get these up. Lights around the room achieved. Not big enough to go out into the dining room. All right, looking good. There's our little skinny Halloween tree. But what we tend to do is we elevate it up on this, like almost like this breakfast tray, like that you would have on your lap in bed. So we put that short back on. Goodness! 
So that then sits a little bit higher. And then we get, uh, is it those green lights? Yeah. Yeah, they're like battery powered lights, aren't we? That we then put around the tree. And like you say, you can see it's a little bit higher. So that's, uh, that's, that's good. Would you like this romantic rose from me? A dead rose? Yes. We have achieved the interior decorations. A few little hanging things there. The bat. Had that bat a few years. So I think what we'll do now is we'll get rid of the boxes. We'll put them back up in the loft and then get the outside adorned. I think the kids will be happy. Obviously it will be in, you'll see it much better tonight. Like tonight when everything is all lit up in the night. Let's go build a graveyard. So yeah, let's <laughs> gonna say, let's get the outside things done. All right, we did it. My pin that's just arrived. Oh. Disney have sent me that for becoming a Disney cruise specialist. With your... With my travel. Travel agency yeah. thing. As an independent... As an independent travel agent, I am now a uh, Magic Ahoy Disney cruise specialist, level three certified. Excellent. So can you wear that with, like, pride? I can wear that with pride. Is it pride. an actual pin? It's an actual pin. Look, it's got the little <sighs> Mickey Mouse pin backing. Oh, yes, I love it. How awesome is that? Let's go on a cruise. Yeah, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Well, if you want to go on a cruise, look me up. <laughs> yeah, um, details in the description. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Absolutely nothing to do with Halloween, but oh, I do love Hero Quest got the brand new game system here which is a couple of years old and the OG version nice we did it we did Halloween decorations are up looking good we'll go and get the kids in a bit from school they'll obviously run in and be very excited they'll be very confused it wasn't like this when they left <laughs> It wasn't. Like we said a few times on the channel, we do we do love Halloween. As a family, we, we love and enjoy Halloween. Et we love any excuse to dress the house up, don't we? Well that's right, yeah, we do like it. We do like our decorations. I think we've done a good job. I think it's looking good. Yeah, we've got the mantelpiece there all looking Tree number one. Yeah. Tree number two over by the window. window. Awesome. Right. Well, we are going to leave the video there. I do hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to do all the usual YouTube stuff, like, subscribe, smash the bell. Check us out on all of our socials at The Bright Side. So from us to you, cheers and, and gone. gone. Happy Halloween. The Eye of a Skull.